a blizzard warning in effect west of the bay and a uh, blizzard watch on the eastern shore. So that's uh, the setup. The blizzard means that we're going to have strong winds, and that really is the thing that might do some damage as far as knocking some limbs down and things like that, wires down, perhaps. Blizzard warnings are issued when we expect winds gusting or sustained winds over 35 miles an hour. Visibility reduced to a quarter mile or less because of snow or blowing snow, and we think we're going to meet this criteria late Friday night and during the day on Saturday. High pressure to the north is strengthening tonight. That's pumping in the cold air, so we're going to be locked into the cold. Low pressure on the Gulf Coast is pumping out the rain and some heavy thunderstorms. Severe weather threat, tornado watches in effect on the Gulf Coast. And look at that on the wraparound back colder side. Some snow is starting to mix with the rain in northern Louisiana. So that's the storm system that's going to bring us the wintry conditions. Right now it's more like a spring storm, but once it makes that turn near Charleston, heads for the Outer Banks and up toward Norfolk, that's when the moisture will spread into the cold air here. And we expect snow that could become heavy at times tomorrow night into Saturday. Snow approaching the D.C. area by 2.30, probably getting into the Baltimore area toward the end of the rush hour at least, between 5 and 6 o'clock, and then continuing to track on up toward Cecil County as the evening wears on. Notice the rain down around Ocean City as some warmer air moves in, but this snow will be in the Baltimore area and central Maryland right through Saturday into Saturday night. And since it's going to be here for so long, coming down at a good clip, we're thinking anywhere from 12 upwards of 24 inches in the Baltimore uh, metro area to the east where some rain or sleet mixes in. You'll have lesser amounts, but I think even much of the central eastern shore will go over a foot. And then you get down to uh, 6 to 12 and maybe less than that right on the beach at Ocean City with the strong onshore winds. If you're going up into the Blue Ridge Mountains or you had plans to, it would be very tough because we're looking for about three feet of snow up on the Skyline Drive in northern Virginia. Now that's the snow, but the wind will also come with this intensifying storm system. These are wind gusts that we expect around 7.30 Saturday morning. Notice all the 50 mile an hour gusts from Baltimore across the bay down to the coast and 40 mile an hour gusts all the way back to the foothills of the mountain. So windy and quite snowy Friday night and during the day Saturday. 16 to 23 tonight under clear skies and maybe a peak at the sun early Friday morning before it clouds up. Snow coming in after 5 o'clock. High temperatures only in the low 30s. Mountain temperatures stay in the 20s with heavy snow out there as well. Eastern shore very windy as the storm rolls through. Maybe a little sleet or rain mixed in Saturday. And down at the coast, that's our best chance for rain as temperatures Saturday get into the 40s. Seven-day forecast for Baltimore. Sunshine returns on Sunday and Monday. And then a weaker storm arrives on Tuesday.